that they can perhaps take the slate, but I think they... It was just to uh, kind of dispel the Cinderbrew there more than anything, but it's going to give uh, Dream a couple of CS, a couple of Deniers here as well. But meanwhile, in the middle lane, GP catch your just get a kill. Which is obviously not correct. Meanwhile, blah, 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 and trouble in the bot lane, getting chased down by Dream, trying to run himself away, using the drunken brawler to get the haste on Dream. And Dream can't chase him down any further than this. Meanwhile, Sayu trying to finish off the kill onto FNG, but GPK comes in and grabs himself a tasty little support. Get a lot done. And GPK is actually turning up to this top lane here. I'm wondering if he's going to get scouted out. He certainly does. And the roar comes out, though. It's a little bit too late. Blinding Light going to buy Elmo a little bit of time, but I think it's too late. He's going to get dropped. GPK grabs another kill. They're not going for the courier. They're going for the big kill here. Shasha is going to be the target. Homie Missile comes down. Will O Wisp as well. That's a cooldown. The roar comes out onto the gyro. That's going to slow him right the way down here. With the balls attacking him, he's really, really slow. But they'll blast back Shashlo into the Blinding Light. And uh, Elmo should be able to grab this kill nice and safely. Mm -hmm. Time that's needed. But, uh... Ooh, FNG does get caught out by the Avalanche here in the Haste of Tiny. Going to continue the chase, but he needs a little bit more. I don't think the toss back alone. Well, he's got heroes. He's got friends. FNG getting burnt down pretty low here. The Thunderstrike plus the Cinder Brew and a right click from a Poshka. Oh, no, actually, Sayo gets the kill. Nice style. Uh -oh. That's a glimpse onto FNG. Yeah, this one he might not be so happy about as they are able to chunk him down quite quickly. Nick's grabbing himself a kill. So or not. But they're smoking immediately, so... Uh oh, this is a might... swap. This is a kill. Goodbye, Maposhka. Just disintegrated in the river. Trying to see if they were doing Roshan and... Uh... MG. Gonna be able to see Bow, Bow, Bow here. Can he get the swap? Yes, he can, but the split comes out in time. Hellraisers, do they want to follow up from this, though? Doesn't really look like it. Nice glimpse, though. Back onto FNG. Gonna bring him out of position here, and I think Elmo and Maposhka are gonna be able to get to work here. He tries to go for the swap round on the backside, but it's not gonna be enough, although a nice curse from... Vampire, he's, he's bringing Elmo down seriously low here. Gambit might want to follow up from this one. Dream, he's just running in. He's, he's got, he wants to get the Omni-Sash off, but the ultimate, he gets caught out here a little bit. Can they have all up the damage though? No, they cannot because GPK is in and oh my god, the damage coming out is massive, but Nyx does manage to pick up the jug on the backlands. Now it's Nyx versus GPK. GPK going for the ultimate, not cancelled out by Nyx here as he turns around with the avalanche, but this Venge illusion is just sitting on his face and he's got to try and run, but the right click comes in from GPK and that's going to be all five dead. The race is trying to fight around their shrine. It could be a good fight for them if they're able to take this fight near their shrine. And they could get some buybacks TP into it. Nyx is going to be the initial target. The roar comes out on him with a BKB pop from GPK. They will be able to bring down Nyx. Elmo as well. Try to fight up on the front lines there, but he just can't handle the damage. GPK is just dishing out way too much. They're going to have to uh, clear themselves out and uh, just add insult to injury, by the way. They drop a repair kit. The GG is cooled. I mean, that that that's going to be it. There is nothing else which Hellraisers can do. They, and they use um, Tornado and uh, incredibly strong. So up on the top lane, they're putting a ton of pressure. Elmo might be in some trouble here. Actually, the right click's coming through. They're going to need a couple more. He's going to yeah, jump through dead. the tree. Shashlo trying to chase. See him with a slowdown, but the right click comes in. Yeah. Look at the right leg damage coming out from him, but you just have to be careful. The slows are here from both Poshka and Elmo, and they will start stapping up those uh, Fury Swords the moment they turn around and start attacking someone else. Mind you, Zabal's getting very low here. Vampire might Rest well drop, back. but Elmo also dropping low, and they're both going to fall. Much better for Gap. Well, we should probably be looking towards top lane as they seem to be fighting for the bounty runes. The Evoke has come over, and he's thrown the Venge up into the air, and my goodness, that rather nature did a lot of damage. And Poshka also dropping pretty low here. Might just be forced to fall. Yep, with that, uh, it wasn't even a Spirit Venge. So that was just a uh, owner of shadows and some treants. It's enough to bring down those squishy supports. Meanwhile, down to the bottom lane, they managed to get the kill onto the Legion Commander. Elmo getting himself out of here as well. Later coming over to him. Immediately looking to make something happen down at the bottom. Maybe looking to splash to the tower. Meanwhile, the puck gets swapped into danger right now. And this is going to be a pretty easy kill for Hellraisers. They will grab Actually, <laughs> You could say that. Meanwhile, uh, this is Maposhka in trouble. Wanted to see if he could get a ward down. Unfortunately, we'll just face the force at his oh. feet and immediately dewarded as well. Look at the pings coming out there. Oh no, they catch the Ursa. He was going for the TP and the sound was made, but unfortunately, they are still going to be able to find him. However, a nice jump over the tree is going to maybe get him to a modicum of safety. Meanwhile, they get a big kill over in the jungle as the uh, Terror Blade's brought down. Elmo still giving them the happy feet right now, utilizing the Earth Shock very nicely, but now they have the Doom, they have the Cold Snap, they have the Urn, everything, the whole plan. Planet Earth, the whole kitchen sink thrown at the Ursa, and uh, he's just gonna get run down like the dog he is. Actually, he's a bear, not a dog. Dying is, is almost impossible, and she's gonna get this blink now. They're gonna run it. They should run a gambit. 
Bottom lane, McPush could all getting caught. Yeah, he's out of there pretty quickly and not in time for Hellraiser. Ooh. Not really showing it though. Ooh, caught here. Okay, a tornado comes in to respond though, and once again, Gambit just diffusing situations time and time again. Sayu's still searching though. Could get a swap on someone. Meanwhile, in goes the TA getting doomed up immediately. Look at the damage coming out from Dream. Oh my goodness. Nixos gets taken out straight away, and they're just dropping like how flies. Dream comes in and smashes absolutely. Pretty ideal circumstances here for Gambit as they suddenly find themselves in a dominant lead in this game. Poshka's like, please sir, stop stop hitting our tower. It's gotta go in with the ultimate here. Um Poshka. Alright. Yeah. So Crystal Overrating the army, perhaps they just play their game, you know? Top the catch for you. Okay, alright, this should be a kill. Uh, bringing down the Fury. Need a little bit more damage, but they oh will God. be able to find Stop it. Thinking. The rest of the heroes coming in, but they're a little bit dodged out nicely. Roshan dropping so low here. Is there any chance for a steal? I don't think there is. Nyx will finish the job. Aegis goes into his hand, but they have put in the call for this one. Dream coming forward. Nyx has to be careful. They do have the Doom available. Don't want to use it on an Aegis target, though. The right clicks come in. Chasing Hellraisers back up to the high ground. A beautiful cheese from Shashal actually catching on Elmo, but he's able to jump over it. GPK, though, up onto the high ground, forces his way up there and finding a tornado onto Sayu. That brings him beautiful out of position here and they'll be able to hammer down on that vengeful spirit meanwhile the doom does come out onto the ursa that's a better target no aegis on him and the ursa this teddy bear he's gonna sleep tonight down goes in here but look at this they're just on the high ground gambit they don't even care they've got a couple more seconds left on metamorphosis they want to try and make some use of it buy back back on elmo though that's gonna put them in some danger and a beautiful swap back into the duel do they have the damage though yes they do down goes dream now they look for more the next target who's gonna be gpk clumsy net comes out onto him he's gonna get the invis off do they have the vision you better now gpk is also gonna be following their carry to the yeah, it's, it's like... FNG's mad. He just got his bounty rune stolen, but he's jumping forwards onto the Ursa, and uh, GPK coming over as well. That's going to be in some real trouble. Yeah, it's got the ultimate. The Tornado will miss as well, which isn't bad. They've got the Doom in one second as well, so Elmo, they don't even need it. They're just going to go in with the right click and grab themselves like these high agi heroes, and uh, Toe Blade is definitely that. Uh, they All do bring right. down FNG though, looking for a plus one perhaps here, so I can get the swap, it could definitely be an opening here, Vampire might be the target, Clumsy Net comes out onto him a long, long way, that net goes, Meanwhile, Shashlow and loading into the Ventral Spirit right now, but Ventral Spirit, he'll be alright, does have a swap if he wants to use it here, he gets a purge off early, he's not going to do anything, going to get run down inside those trees, meanwhile, Dream, Vampire chasing forwards, but Hellraiser's a backwards right now, it's a five for a five, a buyback on FNG though, they want to go right now, and he's TPing full for this one, but we might have gotten caught out here, Shashlo TP's on top of him, Miposhka, not much he can do, not much anybody can do, I think this Legion Commander is just dead. To deal with this one, Ninja Commander can come in, she does a lot of damage though, Delusion, trying to get the duel but doesn't quite manage it, still gets the science off, but the Terrible just turning around and fighting and look at the damage coming out, oh goodness, TA, the Legion Commander as well, they just disappeared, vaporized on the map by the damage of this alacrity dream hero, it is just destroying them and the base is being taken right now. And um, Maposhka dares come close. Good night, sir. You get destroyed. Nope. It. The game is over. Hellraisers, they let it slip from their fingers. Nick's trying to make a last gasp effort.